We've got the Helinox range set up in store today, guys. We're gonna go through them and check them all out. We're gonna start off down here with the zeros. Now, when you're looking at the zeros, we've got three options. We've got the standard zero, the zero high back, and the zero large. Now, these are a great option for hiking, bike packing, pack rafting, anything where you might need to carry this on your back or maybe on your bike, because um, obviously, they're gonna keep that weight down. Even for a light chair, and keep in mind, I'm not light, holds up really well, and it's just fantastic, you know, for you around the campfire sit, hiking, even when you need to sit down for a while off the trail on an ultralight hike. Now in the zero range, you've got your standard zero, which is our lightest Helinox that we have in stock. When you go the large, you're just gonna go a little bit bigger. So if you are a bigger person like me, you might wanna go up to that because it's not much weight gain as far as your pack goes, but it might be a touch more comfort. And then we've got the high back. Obviously a bit more luxury, a bit more weight, but sometimes it's worth it on the trail. So moving through the range from the zero, we come up to the one, which is one of our most popular Helinox chairs in the range. They come in a variety of colors. They've got this mesh back, which is nice for keeping you cool in summer. Keeps the weight down a little bit in the mesh too, because obviously you've got a touch heavier, touch more robust base. Still perfect for backpacking, bike packing, and chucking in your pack raft at the end of the day. Moving through our one range, we also have the big one, the XL. Now, this probably isn't gonna be your hiking, bike packing chair, but if you want a fantastic chair that you can not only fit you, but a large dog on, and this might be the chair for you. Next up in the range, we've got something a little bit different from Helinox. Now this is their cafe chair. This is perfect to set up around a picnic table. So you're walking in with three or four of them for a picnic with the family for the day. These ones are fantastic because they're much higher and they tuck really nicely into a chair. Also, you can sit forward, you can eat on them. Moving on from the cafe chair, we come to one of my personal favorites in the range. This is the sunset chair. Now, it's a great, hybrid between something you can throw on your back and walk into the bush or sit around a campfire with and chuck in the back of the four wheel drive. Especially for someone like me who doesn't mind packing in a bit of extra weight, I'm quite happy to walk with this one for miles. And it's great for bird watching or hunting. I can sit up here with my binoculars nice and comfortable or I can sit back here and just entertain everyone around the campfire like I usually do. So moving on from the sunset to the Savannah, which is the XL Deluxe Big Daddy of the range. Now, the Savannah's got a lot of similar features to the Sunset. It's got really nice back support, neck support, and a cool feature of both of these two chairs is you can take a jumper or even the pack that they come in, push it in through here, and create yourself a nice little headrest. Now, the Savannah is much more towards your comfort edge, sitting down, a couple of bevies, cooking by the fire, but at the same time, still packs down, like all of these chairs do, to where you can comfortably throw them in the backpack for a day, carry them into the park, or head out for four days in the bush. Now, we're gonna take a look at a couple of the accessories for these Helinox chairs. Now, especially pertinent to us up here in the snowy mountains is this awesome little fleece line cover. And we can get covers through for basically the entire Helinox range. So if you wanna get a bit toastier, you can chuck one of those on. Adds a bit of weight, of course, but you know, comfort always does. So moving on from our fleece cover, we're taking a look at our Vibram ball feet. Now these are fantastic if you're in a bit rougher terrain, sand, mud, or slightly uneven, you can run these. They're just gonna give you a bit more surface area, which really grabs on nicely to mud or sand and stops these feet sinking in. Plus they're fantastic. If you forget your beach cricket ball, you've got a small dog or a child you need to keep entertained for a few hours. Now the last accessory we're gonna look at here is our ground sheet. I've got it clipped onto our Savannah chair here. And obviously, being up in the mountains, we don't have that many beaches, but we do like heading across the mountains down to the coast every now and again, and this will hold perfectly in the sand. Also adds a little bit of rigidity just to hold you up nicely. So hopefully guys, if you're heading out on a backpacking adventure, bikepacking adventure, pack rafting adventure, or a four wheel drive adventure, you'll have a Helinox chair to go with you that will suit your needs and your style.